नमस्कार वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल अगेन टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी न्यू थेरेपी टिल नाउ माई ऑल द वीडियोज आर फॉर द हीलिंग स्पिरिचुअल हीलिंग एंड द मेडिटेशन बट नाउ टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी द न्यू थेरेपी विच इज कॉल द कपिंग थेरेपी दिस इज बेसिकली अ टी सी एम ट्रेडिशनल चाइनीज मेडिसिन वील सी हाउ टू प्रैक्टिस दिस दिस इज बेसिकली फॉर द Uh, back pain, lower back pain, shoulder, neck pain. This is common nowadays. So there are different ways to uh, get uh, relief from uh, back pain, shoulder pain. But uh, uh, how to practice this uh, cupping therapy? We will see today. So there are different ways to do this cupping therapy. There are different uh, types of cups also. So we will uh, generally use the silicon cup. This is called the dry cupping. There are two ways to practice cupping. One is the dry cupping. One other way is the wet cupping. Uh, today we'll see a simple uh, to how to practice this basically. Uh, what are the benefits of this cupping therapy? Is it increases the circulation in the muscles so that uh, uh, there will be no stiffness in the muscles and there will be no pain. It says that uh, there are different uh, as per the tra traditional Chinese medicine, there are different meridian lines on the whole body. So yes, we can work on the meridian points, meridian lines, so that uh, the particular area will be relaxed. So let's see how to do this. Uh, this is always advisable to practice with the uh, TCM practitioner if you are going to practice it. If you are, would like to have this uh, experience, this uh, session, definitely please uh, go to the uh, certified practitioner and then only it's advisable to experience this. But this is a very beautiful uh, treatment wherein it takes uh, 15 to 20 minutes of time. So after this we will be more relaxed. So I am going to use uh, the silicone cups on this today. And uh, let's see how it works <coughs> and how to do there are different, as I said, ways to practice. And we'll show you the way how to practice this. Let's see. Please come. See, this is basically <coughs> a whole back. Uh, you can work, if you wish you have a problem in the lower back, you can work on the particular area. If you have a problem in the shoulders and neck, then you can use this area, particular area, wherein you can place the cups and uh, suck the air from the cups. So there is a <coughs> no, one thing where it's which you need to uh, always uh, uh, keep in mind that uh, there will be red marks on your back wherever you are placing the cups and it takes uh, at least around one week of time to uh, get out of that mark. But yes, definitely it shows that uh, how is your um, particular area's health. You can say if the too much dark red color is there and it says that the toxins are there or the blood is not pure. It's this is the thing behind this but um, yes if you the marks will be there and it takes some time but uh, uh, many people uh, ask me this is this is the painful because it looks very red color uh, it looks like uh, uh, while doing it it has too much pain but uh, uh, let me tell you there is uh, no pain basically a little bit pain when you suck the air from the cups and this is because of the negative pressure we remove from the uh, cups so it takes it has a little bit pain but uh, it's not so painful that uh, you cannot uh, bear it. Uh, this is a beautiful experience. Let me see. Let me show you how to do. The uh, before starting, it's advisable to uh, make your uh, the patient's uh, uh, back relax. You can practice a few massage techniques. Uh, use uh, or you can use oil or you can use a cream to do this massage so that the whole back will be relaxed as well as the shoulder and the neck. And then you can uh, start uh, placing the cups. Uh, we'll show you how to do this. Uh, this is a very simple, uh, like you can also practice it, but it takes some time to get the experience. So this is the silicone cup we have. So this has, this kind of cups we get in the market. Uh, there are different, uh, again, um, uh, sizes and the shapes like uh, 6 pieces, 12 pieces, 24 pieces. So this is basically, there is a wall, a small wall. This is the machine wherein we can remove the air from this cup. Like this, you can remove the air. air. Now, you can place the cup like this and you can just remove the hair. This is again depend on the person, which area you need to cover it. If you have a lower upper back pain or the shoulder neck pain, you can work on the shoulder neck only. So there are different sizes of the cups again. It depends when, where you would like to place it. So slowly, slowly you can apply the cups. But, but please make sure that uh, the body should be relaxed first. The, the uh, patient should be relaxed mentally as well as physically so that you can get you get the exact benefit of the thing. 
Let's see what we'll do today. We'll show you how to do the whole back. We'll cover the whole back. Slowly you can cover the whole back or as I said, if you have a lower back problem, so you can work on the lower back only. It's up to you. See now, this is the upper back as well as the middle back. Now I'll place a few cups on the shoulders also, on the shoulder area. This is covering the whole shoulder. So we'll place two more cups. Now this is covering the whole shoulder and the upper back. It's advisable to keep these cups. 5 to 7 minutes, not more than that. So but this way you can apply it. Keep it like this for 5 to 7 minutes. You can see the skin, the whole skin, it you know removes the air and it sets the skin. That's why the red marks will be there. But uh, this is very good to increase the circulation in the particular area. What happens in the cupping therapy is basically so it, this is very good for the detoxification also. So it will increase the blood circulation in the particular area so that the stiffness in the muscles will remove the fresh blood will come and this is very good for the detoxification that's why there will be no pain. So after placing this as I said we'll wait for some time and then the same way how we place it we'll remove it. Let's see the simple way to remove it you just need to remove the wall the air will be go out then you can Take out the cups like this. If you keep it for 5 to 7 minutes, very slowly, now you can see the red color. These are the red spots basically. Slowly, slowly removing the cups. Yeah, after removing the cups, then again we need to do some massage so that the circulation will be increased. You can use again the oil or uh, cream. Uh, whichever you like and you can do some massage so that the whole back will be relaxed. So this is basically a, a short video on how to practice the cupping therapy. Uh, it's a beautiful experience and it takes some time to um, uh, keep the uh, cups on the back as, uh, as we have limited time so that I finish it quickly. But it's advisable to keep 5 to 7 minutes so that you get the exact benefit of the cupping. After cupping therapy it's always advisable to keep drink, uh, drink plenty of water. Uh, as the body will be in detoxification process is uh, not advisable to have tea, coffee, soft drinks at least for half an hour or one hour and this is also not advisable to go for any um, hard work like swimming or working uh, workout in the gym or um, any mental you know, uh, hard work like working in the office immediately attending meeting and everything it takes time to relax the body and uh, uh, take rest for half an hour will enhance the effect of this uh, beautiful treatment Thank you very much for watching this and uh, definitely I would like to tell you one more thing that uh, in, in my next video we'll see uh, the fire cupping is so beautiful uh, again one of the best uh, treatment in traditional Chinese medicine. Thank you very much once again and have a nice day.